let me tell you who the most attractive man in the world is. That is a man of God. Men of God can have everything from a woman, a real woman, a woman of God, because that is rare. There's a lot of men who say God first. There's a lot of men that say they're a Christian. There's a lot of men that say that they are a man of God. And they may even have titles like pastor, preacher, whatever. But a man who actually hears from God, who's sensitive to the spirit of God, that is so attractive. Because the Holy Spirit is attractive. The anointing is attractive. There's a sense of safety that a woman feels from a real man of God. Because their accountability and their loyalty is to God. So that is why a real woman gravitates towards a man of God. People think that women are checking for all these other things, and some might be, but that's not impressive. The material possessions you have, not impressive. At this point, there's plenty of people who have money, plenty of men who have titles, status, all these things. It's a man of God who is very valuable And that is what most real women want. So don't get it twisted. All those other things, it's cool. Like material things or, you know, being physically attractive. That's definitely a plus. However, a real man of God who have integrity, who have leadership skills and ability, that is who can have everything from a real woman. So I think it's important to realize that a lot is changing. A lot of women specifically are recognizing their value in terms of how God sees them. There's a lot of women who are waiting for a kingdom spouse. So I really think that men should understand that is what we're attracted to. We're not attracted to a man who doesn't know how to lead because ultimately he will lead a woman into destruction. And when a man doesn't have purpose, that's so unattractive. You have to have purpose. Otherwise, how could you lead your family? How could you be the head of the household if you don't have no vision or no purpose? Nobody wants to be led into destruction because the man's responsibility is to lead. A man's responsibility is to be the head of the household. So understand that Yeah, you can spend your whole life attaining wealth and material possessions, but that is not what makes you a high-valued man or woman, whatever. The value is in your character. The value is in your morals because God forbid you lose all that. Are you less valuable than you were when you had it? So you have to get back to the basics. What's most important is your character. And a part of having character is having a relationship with God because God is who teaches you who you are. He shows you who you are and he teaches you how to have integrity, how to be responsible, how to be, how to love. So just know that it's time to get right with God because Listen, nobody cares about the superficial things anymore. That means nothing. You can't be high value if you don't have a relationship with God.